On average, the black dollar circulates for about six hours in a black community. We need to do better as a community to support black owned businesses, but that's sometimes easier said than done. Before we can support black owned businesses, we need a readily available economic search engine to be able to find those black businesses to support in our communities. The Central Black Business app is the answer to that question. The EBA is always on the community side, meeting the community's needs with easy access. Hello fam, welcome back to the African Diaspora News Channel. I am Ungil Zalalem bringing you this report. Today's report is about Vanessa Nkete, who is an environmental activist and she's a young lady from Uganda. We've talked about her here on this channel before for the injustice that she has faced. I'll, I'll just show you a reminder of that in a little bit, but I want to first show you why we're talking about her right now. She literally tricked world leaders into admitting that they are liars. Let me show you this clip, we'll come back and discuss. So if you let me, I would like to ask one question to the ministers. Which ones? All the ministers. You have a question for all of them and you want them all to reply. They just I need need to go to home and get a change of clothes. They just need to give me a thumbs up. Ah, oh, that's a good one. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Thank you. Especially the ministers from the global north. Do you think that the people who are least responsible for the climate crisis and the ones who are suffering some of the worst impacts of this crisis deserve our help? Thumbs up. Higher up. So all of you believe that the people who are suffering right now deserve our help. So I'll ask a second question. Will your countries commit to putting money and finding loss and damage for those countries at COP27? <laughs> now that's where the problem is. My first question is like your statements. You're promising us. You're talking about what you're going to do. And my second question is about real action. Loss and damage is happening right now. We can't adapt to the loss of our cultures, the loss of our identities, the loss of our histories. We can't adapt to extinction or to starvation. We cannot adapt to loss and damage. So the first question equals to your statements, promises, pledges, sweet nothings. And the second question is about action. But everyone saw how the ministers were hesitant to say that their countries will commit to funding loss and damage at COP27 in Egypt. Thank you. So let me just... How smart is she? And she's so young. And this is the kind of people that we need, right? And so this same girl was the one that we've covered before, I believe a year or two years ago, when a media outlet decided to cut her out of a picture because she was black. The Associated Press News Agency cropped out Vanessa Nakat, a Ugandan climate advocate. The photograph was taken after a press conference in the Swiss resort where she had been invited along with her four fellow activists at the annual World Economic Forum. Vanessa was in tears when she found out she had been removed from the photograph. This is the first time in my life that I understood the definition of the word racism. And they have the guts to, to change the photo without even giving an explanation or giving an apology. Does that mean that I have no value as an African activist or the people from Africa don't have any value at all. 
but we don't deserve this. Yeah, that's the same person that embarrassed all those leaders. Anyways, fam, let us know down below what your thoughts are about how Vanessa tricked the ministers into telling her the truth. I am Wangil Zalalem. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Make sure you pick up my two books that's in Amazon right now. The first one is Past Aggressive Racism and the System of White Supremacy. And I talk about in that particular book how the system of white supremacy really runs and on our daily lives here in America. In our latest book, Seven Steps to Decolonize the Mind, we go through those steps to try to deprogram you uh, from the system of white supremacy. Make sure you can pick up those books on Amazon.com.